Hey. Drink in my scissors, I'm trying to be the scissor, hey. Hey. Drink in my scissors, I'm trying to be the scissor, hey. They ain't never give me none. They ain't never give me none. Hey. They try to keep a lot up in the system. Drink in my scissors, I'm trying to be the scissor. So we're here to discuss Sister versus Little Fish. Yeah, man. Uh, how did you come up with that concept? Sister versus Little Fish concept. I was just sitting at home one day and I was just thinking to myself, like, damn, you know, it's a lot of people that's out here in these streets and they trying to, you know what I'm saying, beat the system and can't beat the system. You know what I'm saying? If you think about it, the system is what's holding everybody back. I mean, if you think about it, you mess around, you out here in these streets, you get a drug charge, next thing you know, you caught up in the system forever. You got an F on your report card. You know what I'm saying? You can't beat that. We like little fish out here, you know what I'm saying? And the system... You know, they just try to hold us back. It's like putting a dam in the river and you can't swim over the damn dam or go up under the dam because they got the gate closed. You know what I'm saying? So I just was like, damn, trying to figure out how can I beat the system. You know, everybody ain't, ain't dealt the same cause as everybody else. Everybody don't have a mama and a daddy at home together. Everybody don't have, you know, the same type of environment as far as living and growing up as everybody else do, you know? So it's kind of like you got to take what you got in order to survive. And it's kids out here, you know, in these streets, you know, 12 and 13 years old, believe it or not, they're out here selling drugs, you know what I'm saying? Because... They mama, they ain't, they mama don't have a stable job or whoever they stand with ain't got no stable job and they want some money in their pocket. They want to be able to go do this, that, and the third, you know, and they ain't got no money to do it. And they get tired of asking. So what they result to is what's, you know, easy at hand is that's, you know, in these streets, you know, because everybody, oh, you 13, you can't get a job. Or you got to have this or you got to have that. And then people look at you in a certain way. And they just be like, nah, I'm not going to hide you. So they was up to what's next. And I was just sitting down and I was like, you know what? I got to make something for everybody. Because this song right here is for everybody. And whether you do have a mom and daddy at home, you know, that you can go to, you still at the same time. Say, well, I want my own money, you know? And you get tired of asking your mama and your daddy. So this this right here is a heartfelt song to where, you know, individual can say, hey, you know, I'm like, I'm caught up in this system and I'm trying to beat it. So that's how I came up with the concept, system versus little fish. And really what made me really sit down and really think about it, you know, at two hand was, look at Meat Mill. Meat Mill went to jail over nothing. They kept this man locked up and incarcerated for nothing. You know? And, you know, Meat Mill, you know, he a big inspiration to me because of the simple fact of he came from nothing. He came from the streets. He ain't buy his way in and nothing. His mom and dad ain't buy his way in and nothing. Like some of these rappers, their parents be buying their way in and stuff. And then next thing you know, they blow up from the charts like that because they mama and they daddy done pulled out a bankroll instead of you really out here grinding for what you trying to get. You know what I'm saying? So really the song is a reflection of, like I said, everybody that's in these streets, look at Rollo, look at NBA Young Boy, you know what I'm saying? Look at, you know what I'm saying, that boy Kodak Black, all of them, you know, they came from the streets. They grind their way out. So I was just like, shit, system versus little fish. We the little fish out here. To the and viewers, th to the viewers and the watchers out here, who is Young Rich Bandit? Young Rich Bandit. All right, so Young Rich Bandit, that's me as a whole. Young Rich Bandit pretty much <clears throat> sums it all up. Young, 
attitude and ambition as a, as a bandit. You know what I'm saying? Meaning that I'm not going to let nothing stop me from getting to where I got to go. If I got to go and take it to get to where I got to go, then that's what I'm going to do. And meaning in in the smart way, you got to have street smarts and book smarts. I'm educated on both ends. But the rich part, meaning I'm rich is in spirit. You know, my heart is rich. Even though I may not have $100 million in the bank, but just know for sure, I'm going to walk around like I got $100 million in the bank. And I'm going to hold my head high like I got $100 million in the bank. I'm on a $100 million grind at 100000 at a time. That's Young Rich Band. That's my motto. So you consider yourself a role model? I consider myself more than a role model. I consider myself an idol. I'm an icon to these streets. Because people, kids, they look up to me. So I got to set an example for them. And then not only that, you know, I got people that's older telling me, keep doing what you're doing. You know, let us work together and make the society a better place. So I'm a, I'm more than just a role model. I'm an idol. I'm an icon. The Young Rich Bandit Movement. So what does that represent and where are you from? The Young Rich Bandit Movement is pretty much saying don't let nobody try to stop you from where you trying to go set a goal reach that goal set another goal keep going um where am i from from Harlem, new york but you know i was raised up there raised down here in georgia so i put it i'm from two cities you did what i'm saying two states harlem augusta atlanta georgia new york what it is. And anything you would like to get out to the viewers? Yeah, I got a you know an album coming soon. Be on the lookout for that. I got a new track that I'm about to drop called Minutes to the Society. I face some time. You know, I beat the case and try to say I was a menace to society. But at the end of the day, you know, system versus little fish. It's like they charge you with it. You're accused with it, but now you got to figure out a way to get yourself out of it. So, system versus little fish, man. Y'all look it out for it, you know. It's coming out. You know, you can get it on my mixtapes right now. Just listen to the verses and understand where I'm coming from. And then it'll be on Tidal, iTunes, and all that stuff. May 22nd, live. So, just go and check it out. Has anybody told you you sound like Master P? Man... I get it all the time, you know, Master P, that's like, you know, one of one of the people who, when I was younger, I was listening to, you know what I'm saying, Mr. Ice Cream, man, one thing about Master P, he always went and got him some money, at the end of the day, he went and got him some money, and it ain't really all about the money, but people got to understand, you got to have, you know, finance, you got to have capital in order to move forward in this world, you got to have money to eat. You gotta have money to have a roof over your head. You gotta have money to sleep. So, you know, that's what it is. So what you, would you suggest for the young viewers outside? For the young viewers outside, I suggest that, one, stay in school. Two, don't ever take another person's voice or whatever somebody else trying to tell you for what it is. Do your own research. Read the books yourself. Become knowledgeable with whatever it is that you're trying to understand. And not only that, you know, push forward and conquer your goals. We don't risk banning. Y'all know what it is. Hey. Drinking my scissors, trying to be the scissor. Hey. Hey. Drinking my scissors, trying to be the scissor. Hey. They ain't never give me none. They ain't never give me none. Hey, they try to keep a lot up in the system. Drinking my scissors, trying to beat the system.